to invite our pastor, Pastor Kach, to offer us our opening prayer. Yes, I'm welcoming our pastor, Pastor Kach, to do us a prayer for opening the program. I can rise for my prayer. Our Father and our God, Lord, we want to thank you for this day. It's a very special occasion that you've given unto us. Before we start this program, Lord, we call upon your Holy Spirit to come and move around. And may your name be glorified in Jesus' name, I pray. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. We were almost welcoming a brother in a style of profession, but I'm a sema kosawa kwenyako. Tunabukarimisha brother, we will give you a song. Don't worry, we'll get you still. Okay. Now, uh, we have had the procession, and I want to ask that all guests should get seated. Now, I'm going to ask you, 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 I'm I want to trust that the seats are enough for all of us, and I want to ask that let's all be seated. Uh, only those who are getting in should be walking, but those who are already in, Tafadali, to Naomba, to Kaichi. Yes. Um, before, before we start the program, I want to welcome Melodies of Life to give us a peace. Melodies of Life. Thank you. 
that's our first port god. I'm the second port network, Jeff Wanzai. Mr. Welcome to the party. Thank you so much, and you are welcome all of us to the party as we celebrate this legend, this great man. May God be blessed. Uh, my name is Lillian Award, Lillian Award, Dr. Dr. The last one, Karibuli Water. So next, next I want to introduce the in-laws, uh, sister-in-law and the brother-in-laws. Or could you introduce themselves? The people we married and the people who married us. Good <laughs> afternoon, everyone. I'm Alfred Tom, the husband of William and Andrade. Good afternoon, everyone. My name is Fred. My name is Fred Dickowal. I'm married to Miriam Gadas. Thank you so much. Yeah, I'm also happy, happily married. <laughs> so for those who are trying to do something, <laughs> my wife, uh, we live in the United States, so my wife is called Linda. At the end, uh, she's the US now, so she's there with us in spirit. Her parents are here. Uh, next, I want to introduce our very close cousins, Molly and the team. Where are they? They're like our sisters. Uh, yes, I did. Mama Na is the third born after mom. Thank you. Molly, I thought you were married. Where's your husband? Are you available or what? Thank 
saba wa six ukae anasema mmekaribishwa kwenye party ni kupiga sherehe ya retirement of our brother let me call him let me call him Zack for the lack of hiyo uh, Zack ni refu sana mtani kubalele ni mite Zack sawa thank you very much we are moving on well na tunashukuru Mungu i want to get up here first of all i want everybody else that is seated down feel welcome sisi wote tumekaribishwa kwenye hafla hii Kiswahili wako na tema tema lakini kizungu tuta kama problem there so usi don't blame me for using a lot of english shida ni shule unajua siku hizi you must respect photo men because the photo you take in school is very important if you know you know lazima tupige picha si ndio you will be asked some day to produce a photo so allow me to I know I didn't prepare you for this but I want to invite pastor uh, Akaj to invite or to introduce the guest above here after that I will leave the microphone to the church to take us through the sacrament and everything so I want to invite pastor Akaj to first of all I proceed introducing all the guests up here and then we will take it away thank you pastor Karibu Now maybe before I introduce those people who are standing here or rather who are seated here allow me to introduce Central Church elders I am so quite a number here and I want to take this opportunity to welcome them some of them are seated just behind me and on behalf of my elders who are seated behind please can elder your trouble wave to the congregation seated in front here Better you start with the Jerusalem before you go outside. My wife is here. Sister Grace Adiabo from Ghana. Grace Adiabo is coming from Canada. In one way or the other, they are related. Uh, but I'm okay. Most of all. Hi. Hi. Can you walk in here or not? Can you? Here now. Here now. At the Adiabo schools. One again. Just in your sign, eh? It's none other than Brother Maina. Maina Koko uh, is coming from Agoro. He's a friend of Bakat. I mean, he is also here with the wife. But can you just write and maybe introduce your wife? Hallelujah. <laughs> Hallelujah. Yeah. Uh, this is Maina and my wife Melda. Tightly. Jeff's wife is uh, our daughter. Thank you very much. We have Dr. Kiro Nana. The other side with Mrs. Sotero. Uh, can you give the mic maybe and Dr. Kiro can say something? Uh, the only link is that we come from the same village and we were born in the same year. So we are 75 years old. Those who are 75 and above, please stand up. Please stand up. Hallelujah. Ni anabeli ma. I do go to introduce. Ene ni anabeli. Beli mbiro bana. Beautiful. Magoni guasi. I'm a member of Kisumu Central. Tana mema usafiru central ni muse Kituwoni ukibiru Gintie Unano ni chungu mani Na introduce Wano ufuwa mpene Aleluya Moko wako taema reki Moko wako taema mbulu ishi Mano by Ella wa Absaluru SCA Church. Hallelujah. Na kwa sila kumangi. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Mwana wa mungu. Nisiku jema sana. Sana watu wa Sanjuiru Central. Tunafra. Tunakimbia. 
from asubuhi mpaka hapa tumefika. Haleluya. Thank you so much. Praise the living God. Praise the living God again. Mrs. Jakwat Silas Mati. Haleluya. Toro mama ya mchungi. It's my pastor to be. He's at Bugema. It's the second era. Pastor, nyingi tama ni mungu, mungu ni niki mose. Uh, thank you so much, praise the Lord. My name is Pastor Abura Felix, student at Mugemba University, as she has said, and uh, I'm a servant of God in the Seventh-day Adventist Church. We are humbled to be with you, we are humbled to celebrate with you, Zay, and uh, I'm sure he has added more days and more years. May God bless us all, God bless you. Thank you. Thank you very much for that introduction. I uh, know they say it is only in retirement that you will have two times of him and half times of his money. Now, uh, we are continuing and uh, in that spirit, uh, I want to change and get into mode of singing by inviting sunshine ministers to give us an item. After that, I'll give the program to uh, our pastor who will run it according to the heavenly direction. So, such a minister, as I thought you, you're already here. Thank you. They're giving us a peace. And then, 
Uh, Pastor Akai, my friend. Akai, uh, I'm not bad. So, oh, I don't need to be a teacher to get more people. So, here I come around. Now, I want to share with you very briefly, very, very briefly, the testimony of a retirees. The testimony of some retired generals. Heroes of faith. These are the people who were born here on earth. They lived here on earth. God gave them what to do. And they did it. Yes, first of all, 
ne contiene che gana che gana ma di mohere yes che non mi manco ci che ne yes mohero che che era mosti yes to io come c'è the hands of the altar now listen to what the prophet generally say that I want you to know Is there any 
simple thing that God said that he did not fulfill. And then everybody said, no, 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 no. God has done it. That will give up. Thank you for thinking of this uh, kind of ceremony. This is wonderful. I, I, I think you are there and it's place of God inspired you to think of this because many times we, we don't see the people calling God's people so that they may come and say, take you to God the way you have done it today. And we want to say that the same Lord that has taken care of you might fail. It's the same Lord that will still take care of you for the days that you still will live in this world. The days that are not in the side, that retirement and any more active service, but you have a lot of, you, it is now that you have what to do. To your children, to your grandchildren, to your beloved wife, to the church of God, to your people, people will come to you for wisdom, for advice. I don't know if you know, I don't know if you know, God has given you this opportunity so that you may be a blessing to others. To the children of Wanzani, take this. What made the children of Israel succeed? What has made your father to come to this level?
I want your dog waiting in the window to go to the group in Africa. And our, our pastor, Bisho Kuren, from Masedo University, who also we want you to be here. I will request our church members, our central, Sumo Central. We will not really give it here. Kisumu Central members, we want to hand over. Masedo University is handed over to you. They are members to take care. Kuro, your Kisumu Central, I don't know how to do it. I tell you, you don't mind it.
Yes, let's continue. We are to, to the next program. And the next program is Chakwani Chakuru. The next program is Chakwani Chakuru. And get this, I can hear people normally, but then get this one. You know, it is, it is men. That man is how he sells his birthright. You get me? He then will be father is how he can protect the birthright. So we want to eat there in a very good manner so that we don't be able to a salad. So we will have from this table, from this table, let me get this first.
of Maseno, I just want to congratulate Dr. Tari and thank God for this far he has brought him until this hour that uh, he is celebrating his retirement. So mine is to wish him well in his next phase of life. Okay, my name is Dr. Mary Onyango, Department of Pharmacology in the School of Pharmacy, Maseno University. I'm sorry, I need to uh, introduce myself fully. I'm Reverend Father Marcellus Kawasonga from the Department of uh, Foundations and Administration, where we work together with uh, Dr. Wazari. Uh, thank you so much. My name is Dr. Lilian Award. I'm the head of department, Department of Computer Science, Woo! and the University. Thank you.
As uh, my bro Jeff has just said that uh, we are declaring you God as uh, the world's greatest God. Yeah, so I've been asked to say a few things which uh, I will uh, on behalf of the family. <laughs> uh, it's such a great day, as you know, that uh, many of us long for such a day. Uh, some of us work, but uh, exit the employment scene much early. But for somebody to work, through all these years, and uh, retire at the age of 75, and still going strong, uh, give glory to God. Uh, it's the work of the Lord. Uh, we cannot take credit for anything. We can do anything as human beings. But this, all this glory uh, and uh, victory belongs to God. So, congratulations, God. Uh, I know some of you, because it's been an adversary university, for so I think close to 28 years, uh, 32 years, at my 7, 32, 1991. Yes. 99, yes. Yes. And uh, I think most of us uh, maybe know him and think that uh, his story is uh, just around my university, and we're very grateful to the university for being with him for all those. Uh, uh, 32 years, but uh, I know my mom at some point will speak and tell you about his professional journey. But uh, as the first point, I want to say that uh, I have seen it all. I have uh, been with him uh, together with our siblings. Uh, for me, I have been with him much earlier because our, as our siblings were coming home, they were joining me and working with God uh, throughout this professional journey. And uh, the best I can remember is uh, when he joined, whatever happened there before, just like, you know, uh, we don't know anything beyond the kind of head, maybe we have some idea, but God knows. But whatever happened before this, the starting point from the time I started really remembering and uh, knowing his professional journey, I think our man knows. But what I recall is, uh, when he was posted uh, to Maranda High School in Seattle, and uh, I was in Nasale School. The reason why I'm saying this is, if you see a child who can remember what was happening during Nasale School, then you can imagine the kind of boy, the kind of dad he is. I remember very well, I was in Nasale School, he was a teacher at Maranda High School, together with the dad, with mom, and uh, I remember I have very fond memories of uh, even the first bike that he bought for me, three-legged tricycle. I remember it very well. I remember the way he used to go farming, harvesting maize. He used to feed chicken, and uh, every morning and evening we would collect eggs, and some mom would come and collect them. I remember at some point some wild animal or uh, I think it's a wild cat will travel us with the, with the chicken and they will set a trap who will always go along with me to the chicken house and we set a trap using a wire and we will catch this animal. All those I remember very well when we go to the farms and sometimes the maize beans will cut us and at that time there was no spirit. What they used to put is potassium for manganese and it was terribly painful. That just shows you what kind of guy he is. Eh? I don't know whether all of you can remember what was happening when you went to Nazareth School. But from Amanda, I remember very well. We went to KC High School, KC, Sameta High, not KC High School, Sameta High. And there I also have very fond memories of uh, our dad. I think at that point, uh, Jeff was already, but uh, I, I, I can't remember exactly how old, eh? but uh, by then, we were in Sameta, uh, my bro was, uh, uh, I think mom would clarify that, I think my bro was around. But in Sameta High School, personally, so many other things happened. I remember at some point, you know, being a boy and being very playful, we were going to school. Sameta was like, as two, as three, and uh, 
when we are going to school, we play with bees and we saw a bee hive and we threw a stone at it and I almost died. The bees really uh, did some work on us and uh, but we survived. Eh? I remember at some point when I was suffering from tonsillitis and I was admitted at KC District Hospital and they operated on me and I did. I didn't like just the idea of being away from that, being in a hospital ward and so on. So what I did is I escaped from the hospital. Okay? And uh, they later found me at the bus stop. They went to the hospital, they could not find me, they were very scared, but at some point they found me at the bus stop. Okay? Then, uh, yeah, okay. So, then, uh, uh, from Zaveta High School, uh, but I survived that. Uh, they found me, the Lord did one us. Maybe I won't be here talking, but uh, the Lord did one us. Then from Zaveta High School, we went to Bay High School. He was a teacher all this time, okay? So we went to Bay High School, and in Bay High School, we were getting together. At some point, he stopped being a teacher in high school. Then uh, I think he joined uh, Kenya Science Teachers College. And then he will take me to Nairobi to such a great thing, boarding OTC, okay, and I come back to Nairobi. He will take me to the railway station and show me the train, no, I'm sorry. Then from there to Chekwele, Moy Teachers College in Eldoret, and there also we we'll do some farming and so on. Then from there he went abroad, came back. I remember the trip from Eldoret to Kisumu, he joined Maseni. And uh, the very first time when he was going to Maseno, we would go with him, it was not a big boy. So, in summary, I have seen the professional journey of my dad, first part. And for, for me to stand here and till retire, and two people coming here to join us and celebrate it, it is such a long journey, such a long journey, all the way from being a teacher, a tutor, a lecturer, a doctor, you know, the Lord God Almighty has been good. In summary, we have just declared the world's best of God. And the word today, the person, the word, the world's best God, they say everything begins at what? At home. So if you look at us, his children, I think he deserves to be declared the world's best God. If you look at me, my brother Jeff, Indian, Eddie, and our brothers and lords, I think it is just good for us to declare the world's best dad. But we love to add that is also, because I've seen it first time, it's also the world's best husband. Okay? Thank you so much. Yeah, as the next is speaking, most of the words have been uttered by the first one. So just one word as we move on, because time is not on the side. One, one word from me. I remember uh, when Dad was in, uh, teaching in Homer Bay High School, I was very little, but the only thing I remember is this. I used to go to the classroom where he's teaching, and I remember asking him three things when, when I went to his classroom. All I said was, Baba, I don't lie. <laughs> That's all I remember. But Dad, for today, I want to present to you this quadro, so when you're back home in Super, you can walk. Uh, understand the joke? Oh, yeah, for those who don't understand the official language of Kenya. Arwa Lion means I'd like to urinate. <laughs> Baba, okay, here is a mukwadu for you. Give it, you make it a good dog of Baba.
So this is a high where you want it to be the jam. Yeah, so that uh, when he's walking the village or maybe in the towns, we see the in here. Yeah. The next speaker, I appreciate the time you're taking, it's good. Just the next speaker to say what? Is working. <laughs> okay, to let uh, we know that today has been a long day, so we decided to give you two days destination to a non destination. Thank you. 
to balance it, but I'm inviting that family, they say something, and then I'll let you know. We have people from home, and the people from home will be talking, the melodies of life will be behind them. Yeah. And if you're leaving, please, in the table, give you see the table of water, give you the table for the gift is here. We thank Sunshine for gracing the occasion. May God bless you as you continue the ministry. Uh, the other microphone. I want to sincerely thank God for giving us this opportunity to say happy retirement to a friend of ours, a cousin, and an age mate. I am not going to go to the stories, but if I had time, I could have talked about it. The year 1935, there was famine in the region. And most of us, most of our people, left for Tanzania. We were still staying together with them, but we left them in a small place called Shamba, near Magunga. We went down to Kagoro near the lake, where we still stay until today. When you visit them, come to the lake. When I don't want the lake, I go to the hills, where I still stay. So God bless you, Guglielmo. We'll be working together. When I get a consultancy, I'll call you. And if you get what you call me. <laughs> I want to give my wife, my dear wife, opportunity to present her, then I will present mine. This is how you've come. You have been a very, very jovial family that's strong in the Lord, and you have been a wonderful encouragement to me. Especially when I was down with my boyfriend here. You really enjoyed me, and I was very, very glad. We decided with our daughter to buy for you a clock. A wall clock. I know your eyes are now soon going. So I brought one that has bigger digits that you can see even if you're still in bed and wake up at three maybe in the night and pray. And then, and then wake up again at seven to go to the shower. And then you come back home for breakfast at ten. And then you can now go on and write your book on your computer. So let me
they have a song to present. Two, they are also requesting you now that you uh, retired from job. Can you join them now in choir? Yes, you can join them to become a member of Melody, Melodies of Life so they can sing with them. And above all, we want to thank God for that. May the end present this on behalf of Melodies of Life. You can now come. I know there are people from home that will make a statement. But as if anybody with a gift, an envelope or, 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 or any kind of gift, we can do that because now I want to again and we want the family, that is Mr. and Mrs. Wanzai, to also speak to at least some audience. So, uh, Melodies of Life, uh, take it away.
you know, they take his men with a lot of things. They are sweet carrots and very, very bitter carrots. Car car that is how life has been with these two people. Don't think that it has, it has been very good and very smooth. Sometimes they were going through steep slope and sometimes they were okay. So we want to thank God for the challenges that they met in life. And uh, because of this, we want to share this cake. They say we have to share with them this cake. And I thank Thank you. On behalf of our family, I want to take this chance to thank the Almighty God for seeing Dr. Tari go through this. Dr. Tari and Nyawadwa, Mama Helen, Nyawaiti Gudgimara Reo, Linda No. Unfortunately, she's not here, but Yawa Retoriti Ejef Wakamama. Hello, come on. Kuro mai ni pa mi mo se ni nolo kwa hinya. Kendo wange ni mo no marja kwa njasa ni mtu wa kanya. Kuro mi awa kwa yama na ni hera mo se bede no. Kaje mungu retire. Tomo no mo no marja kwa mo no ane. A lot of people don't reach this stage, and therefore we don't take it for granted. We thank God that has given you the time to come up to this level. Kuro gima no mo na. That was Mama Linda. I want to invite uh, power women and the one who are going to move. Is that not the name? We are not, we normally do parental visitation, 
So next year we are still calling you. We are going to Kwasi in style. To thank God for that. So we are really content just to thank God for our parents. We come and we receive, you know, we normally get blessings from our parents. Actually, our second God is our parents. So next year, Epi, I am inviting you officially. We are going in style to Kwasi to say thank you, Mom and Dad, for being the best parents. And parents for all this team, I want to say thank you. They traveled all the way from Nairobi just to come and support me. And that is what we do. We support each other, we build each other, and we are powerful ladies. Thank you. So when we start here, we are actually looking at the, the, the doctors that are seated on that and we, we, we are motivated. Uh, Dr. Professor Onzare, you have motivated us. But behind every successful parent is actually the children. You have successful children, you have raised amazing, wonderful children. So at least in your old age, we know that uh, they will take care of you. You have nothing to worry about. Because you have worked, you have raised them, you have disciplined them, and clearly you have, because we, work, we are the ones who can tell you what they do behind the scenes. So, <laughs> so you have disciplined them, the D and mom, you've done an amazing job. There are people with amazing characters. I think I know all of them, and they are wonderful people. So feel happy and rejuvenated that even when you are retiring from active service, you have people to take care of you. And I want to start by thanking our children. Our children, you have introduced yourself and our children in laws. This organization, everything we had, everything was from these children. So they have started taking care of us. Hallelujah. They organized the everything. I thank you so much. I thank also the Maseno University for your time that you have taken. I know Edna. That time you have moved from far. And I know what you did to that time. And you made me feel that I was a doctor. Because anytime I came to the office, you are giving me an idea. And I was always taking tea. <laughs> Thank you so much. That is the time when dad was very sick. And that to know everything. And the thank you. I was just recording what you have done to our house. Thank you even for the visit. And I came out to the house to see that time when he was stand from the wall. And actually he was sick. To say the truth, I didn't know that he would leave. And I thank God so much that today in Sipna and in Amor, we thank God for everything. Hey, I had a lot to say, but I don't know. Thank you. Uh, a bit of introduction of Dan's life in terms of career has been mentioned, but I want to mention more. Thank you so much. At the university, at the college, serious friends become serious until they get married. Hallelujah. Amen. So when I joined Kenya Sands, the time was just finishing his diploma at Kenya Sands. We knew each other. And he told me, Helen, I'm not leaving you behind. 
before I marry you because I know you are too beautiful that I will, I may not even get you when I still waste time. I said, I also loved him. I said, thank you. And we moved on. I took information to my parents. When he started from school to Guasi, and that's where the sun ends. So I remember my late father asking me, hey, Nathena, kati jabele, kumachi mpogeni, eme yule mbui. Where the sun is ending. I say something, I say thank you. That is where I got the best husband. Thank you so much, that time. And we moved on from Kenya Sands, this diploma, I went to Kenyatta University. This is a, a scholar. He liked his day. And I was always, I tell him, move on, move to Kenyatta, got his degree. He came, he was posted Miranda. And there, I was until in college. I finished. Then he went to Sameta, he went to Homer Bay. From Homer Bay, he left me as a high school teacher. He joined to lecture at Kenya Science. When he was about arranging for me to join in Kenya Science, who is hosted Moi Teachers College. He stayed there a bit. When he's arranging for me to join him, who is taken to Canada, in fact, my transfer had been done by Mr. Boni, and we went and asked him to cancel because I had not stayed in Eldoret, so I could not stay there alone. So I stayed in Mama Bay. He came back, he taught. Marcelli University started as a college. Any woman is moving to Marcelli College, put, put. he went. And when you are in Eldoret, I get. I got promotion with the deputy at Chepasas. We discussed Helen. How do we live in Rift Valley? In the name of deputy, she forget it. Let's go and say that when Sarah Kaka saw what I'm saying, I'm going to be a little bit. I cannot stay alone. So we came to Kusumu. I joined Kusumu Girls. Then I went to Lyons as the deputy. He went back to Canada for his PhD and he stayed. And I said, when I went to Yugo Gango as the principal, he asked me to go and join him, to visit him. I visited him the first time, the second time. And the way you are seeing me, I have stayed in Canada. Hallelujah. Yes, the courtesy of Dr. Juan Sari. Very few men, very few men ask their wives to go to, because when most Africans, when they go there with the Su or Sungu, they are telling, say, they, Helen, come. And you see what I found. Everybody wanted to come and see me. Sex wife has come. That's why I was wondering. Sex wife has come. Was Sungu wana? Kuja wana ta? And I was beautiful. where he was. He told me, Helen, no way they wanted to see you so much. I have a slogan for them. This is why it's very funny. They come, show me this. And it's just, it's, it's a hand, is just next to you. I tell them, I came here alone, and I will leave you alone. If this is what brought you out of my office, there they will give you offices, student meeting offices. So they were wondering, what is wrong with this man? That is Dr. Wansai. I came alone and I will leave it alone. Thank you so much. We came back and they stayed in Maseno. It was very good. I used to go to the tap department. There's a time I called even Professor Nell to come and talk to my student, my senior. And the professor came and I was so happy. When you came, yeah, I'm on. 
So you want until he retired on 12th April. You see the from active service, eh? Yeah? Uh, that is great because there's a student who they, they, they need you. Huh? So you are not retired. Eh? You have just stopped working from the active uh, service. So we am very, very happy. Do you see this man? Eh? Imagine this man at my children. Hey, hold on, and Joseph, can you come and stand next? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Mm -hmm.
this function, this party was organized by my madam Helen Akini and Geoffrey Wanzare, Gordon Wanzare, Lillian Wanzare, and Amy Wanzare. So I'm very and at least this is also doing that in organizing this. I want to say that I'm very happy to see all of you here because of this function. It means quite a lot to our family. It means a lot because I can see that all of you love us. We love what you do. May God bless all of you. And continue doing this. And what I want to see is that whatever you do, and wherever it is, put God first. Because that is really uh, the ultimate reality of life. I'm asking to go in peace and keep on remembering in prayers. But above all, I want to thank Masenga University and the same university staff who came here. You did it very well. It means a lot. Your love for us and for this situation. I'm still part of my same in one way or another. I shall until be coming there to see you. I want to thank the chair lady of that department. <laughs> She really helped me, and I felt great when I left the place. I keep on praying for her and wishing her every success in whatever she did. And if I happen to learn about any scholarship anywhere on this planet, the first person I would consider is herself. Okay, I would wish you every success. Go in peace and let's keep on contacting and facing each other. Now, the power women that visited Eddie. Uh, uh, thank you for coming. You have very good uh, spirits. Keep on with that. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you very much. Now we are getting close to the end. Um, first of all, I want to thank the Almighty God. All this would have happened without the mighty works of God. We may plan, as the Bible says, that uh, we may plan, but God directs our steps. So I know we've been working behind the scenes together as a family, a larger family, through WhatsApp group, several calls to plan this. And uh, uh, I want to thank uh, Brother Jeff, uh, Lillian, and uh, Abby, and our brothers in law, uh, Alfred, and Fred. I don't know what my sisters are thinking of when we are just leaning towards the friends. But, uh, thank you so much for joining us, Bernard, at least. Uh, Molly, uh, you know, we always call you at least. Eh? So thank you so much for, for the effort. Uh, we want to thank our mom and dad. At some point, we decided to hide away from you. We had a WhatsApp group, then we said, ah, uh, watch our total when the content you're white. So we ran away from the WhatsApp group that had you because we didn't want you to know what was going on behind the scene. So we secretly created another WhatsApp group. <laughs> you know, the party is, uh, the function is over, so we can let the cut 
out. Yeah. So, so at some point the WhatsApp group was silent and I will tell that they were getting a little bit worried, but they didn't know that we had another WhatsApp group where we were doing a lot of planning behind the scenes. So I want to thank you all for coming today. I may not mention all of you by name. Uh, I want to thank uh, Dr. Piero, uh, the best couple, Dr. Piero and uh, Mrs. Piero and your uh, lovely daughter. She's a big girl nowadays. The people is very young. Thank you so much for joining. Dr. Piero has been more of like a mentor to me and I'm really grateful. Uh, from the actually, he gave me my first job. Remember that interesting work we were doing at Migosi? I'm not going to those details, but my first job, Dr. Biro employed me. So thank you so much for addressing this occasion. Uh, Jeff's uh, parents in law, uh, thank you so much uh, for coming. We really appreciate the pastors of God, but uh, uh, we are very grateful and thankful uh, to them for coming. Thank you, Lydia, for the work you did coordinating with Marcel University. Uh, and uh, that's, that's a great job. Uh, the choir members have gone from Central and all the Central uh, church members. I know some of them are here. Martha, from those many, you were not big people. Uh, it's wonderful. Huh? Uh, we give glory to God. And uh, we're really grateful to what the Lord God Almighty has done. May God uh, bless you. If I've not mentioned you by name, I want to thank the MC. I can't forget. Yeah? And I'm sure you've done this wonderful work because your wife is around. Eh? Yeah, because they say behind every successful man. DJ from Nairobi, not from Kisumu. No? Uh, the catering uh, department, uh, forgetting the name. Teddy. Teddy, where you can Teddy. Teddy. Teddy, can you just stand? Chef Teddy, Jitasha yeah. Events. Oh, I'm going to be sure, sir. I'm a friend of the Safi Sana, as you see. Uh, our time is budget, and uh, we're really grateful for the work you've done. Huh? I'm forgetting one person who is uh, he goes, uh, he's a little boy, he always, you know, he's always been close to me, we used to play, we go, one day we went to Ochuna, I go to Ochuna, we used to go to Latiga, at some point we came across a very terrible snake, so he's a small boy, and by the way, Ochuna is in Rodi, Kopanya, that is uh, my mom's place. You wouldn't believe it right now if you are driving, it's 12 kilometers. Eh? But those days it was still marrow. And I remember at some point when we were visiting each other, I had this habit of going to Rodi to visit my uncles and they would come back. And we used to walk from Homa Bay to Rodi to visit even for a week. Then they would walk back to Homa Bay. You can imagine where we've come from. So thank you so much, uh, Omosh, and your wife. I think she's somewhere there. Uh, thank you so much uh, for coming. Uh, I may not know uh, your name, but uh, if you don't mind, so that I uh, don't uh, guess. Uh, Jeff, just allow me to give uh, one second to say hi, and also let us know that all is well in the US. Good evening, everybody. Good evening once again. You are all fed and you should be full of energy, so you need to sound more happier than you are. Again, I'm visiting from the US, and uh, the Wanzares are families and relatives, not just friends. So we are related somehow, you know, how as Africans are related one or the other. Now, for that, uh, thank you so much. We thank God for your life, for the examples you've set for us and for the future to come. Pray that God continue to lead you and uh, your love. That's why everyone is here. They're not just here if they don't love you, they love you. Again, thank you so much. Thank you so much. Camera uh, one, photographer, Then uh, we have uh, George. George is the husband to.
the chair lady of the Path of Women. I don't know why he's with us, but uh, he came also, and uh, we are very grateful. You can imagine how powerful he is, being the husband to the chair lady of the Path of Women. Uh, to the school, son, uh, wherever you are, maybe, maybe you can say one word or two. George Murigo, George. 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 Thank you so much, Mom and Dad. I appreciate. Thank you, Marianne and your sisters and brothers. So thank you so much. Yes, uh, I think finally, uh, all right. I want to appreciate and recognize uh, Mama Mundi. Uh, she's one uh, uh, mom I am fond of calling her by name. I hope. You will forgive me if I don't know why she's still with us. Thank you very much, Let us clap with Makofi, Makofi. 
Thank you. Thank you. As we are now, now closing for real. Now closing for real. Let's say hi to us. Hi to every member who has come to say uh, welcome to our Jaguar. Uh, the protocols are broken. Once Fred has spoken, we are supposed to keep quiet. Just the This was the day's session for the room. Thank you. Thank you very much for assisting me break the protocol. Um, now we want to close for real. I want to take this opportunity to thank everybody, even those who have gone. We want to say we are grateful for staying and for listening to us. Everybody who found an opportunity to speak, we thank you. Those who didn't find an opportunity to speak, I spoke on your behalf. So don't worry, even if I said a thing you don't want to say. Anyway, I spoke on your behalf. My name is Dan Okej, the MC of the day. I want to invite uh, Dr. Obiru to give us a closing prayer. Uh, let us clap for ourselves as uh, he is coming. Thank you. May God bless everybody and may we reach our home safely and, and may God just take care of all our endeavors as we start a new week. Thank you. Let's pray. Our oh, Heavenly Father, all the light of our resources, we put man here to work and man has been working since the creation. We have seen your son, Dr. Rosario, working for many years. And we thank you for giving him those much years. Kindly continue to give him more years. Remember the wife, remember the children and their, their, their spouses and their entire family and husband's children. Take care of the relatives, can take care of the friends. Those who attended here today, your Lord be with them. And wherever they go, be with them until they reach their destinations. Continue to be with us. Continue to be with Dr. Anjali. Give him more days. Give him more days. And continue to give him active prayer so that he could continue serving him. This is our, our prayer in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Thank you. We'll be wrapping to that. Till next time.